like I'm just kidding. But anyways, today I'm coming with a video about clothing that I just recently got from different stores. I have stuff from Nasty Gal, from H&M, from Couture Club, and, and Just Fab. So the first piece I'm going to get into right now is this jumper. It's like a twill painter jumpsuit thing from Just Fab. Um, I'll also talk about how I would pair the outfits and what I would wear with it. So this one I printed with the Air Forces. Oh, you can't see. It doesn't matter. I'll put a video so you can like see what the full outfit looks like. And this one, I feel like it's really comfortable. It's a bit big on, but I feel like it's nice. It has like a lot of space. And yeah, I would also make sure to put the link down below if the link still work. And then you can check it out yourself. All right. So, next to the next outfit. Before I forget, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching. I always forget to do like the full on intro, but I always try to get into it. The next um, piece item of clothing is this uh, like distress acid wash sweater from Couture Club. It's a brand in the UK. It kind of it's kind of like big, but I kind of like the fit because you can use this like when you want to feel like Princess Diana if you want to put on some biker shorts i'll make sure to put like a full of what i'm wearing i put i paired it with the black jeans and black dogs um i will put the link down below you have to think if you us people if you want to buy it you have to think about like the transition transaction change and all that so but yeah the next set of clothing are from h&m it's a bunch of blazers and then like one dress so this one i've actually worn it before like the whole outfit it tested really well i wore it to church but most of these outfits i feel like i would wear them to like work so it's like a pink blush blazer i uh, partnered it partnered it i <laughs> paired it with a white tank and then leather pants that have like this split hem and then some forces how are we feeling i feel like it's very like corporate you know corporate america okay the next one is almost like the same as the one before except this time it's a purple blazer with another white tank top and then i paired it with black jeans these have a hole like in both knees if my mom sees this gonna be like why are your jeans so ripped but hopefully she doesn't see this part she's just gonna skip it and then i paired it with these loafers i also just recently got from just fab they have they're like dock looking ish but then they're like just like slip-ons and they're really comfortable i paired them with socks because i feel like it gives me blisters in the back but yeah so i will show you what the whole thing looks like and then these i feel like you could also wear with heels i'm not wearing heels to work maybe if i was to wear this to church i feel like with a different pair of jeans i feel like that would be a look Also, I feel like my hairstyle keeps changing, like Ray J in that one video with the beanie. Like, I'm trying to match it with the looks, but I don't even know if it's working. Let me know in the comments if it's working or not. Okay, another one. This one, I feel like everything up until it gets to the shoes, I really like. So it's a tan blazer with a black tank top and some blue jeans. And I paired it with like brown sperries. In my head, I feel like it looked nice, but then now with it on, I don't know what I would pair it with. I'm tired of being like, oh, what's forces, what's forces? Why do forces have to be the one, number one shoe? But yeah, so I will put a video of what it looks like on, but I really like this color on. It feels so like, I keep coming out. It feels so like formal and nice. Again, a lot of these things I feel like you could wear with like heels and dress it up for like a dress or something. <laughs> I don't know if you guys can tell but i got a lot of blazers because it's not everyday barter sisters blazers as in this is my first time owning like this many blazers i'm always asking my sisters to borrow me so i picked out a lot we're almost through with the blazer there's like one more blazer outfit but this one is just a basic black blazer with the white tank top and then the same blue jeans as i wore before and then the black shoes from just fab so this one is just like a basic on the go again i feel like these things can always be dressed up or dressed down however you want it, but you can never go wrong with having a black blazer in your closet. I feel like I keep cutting myself out. I will try and stay like under the camera. It's getting really techy to do this. 
influencers y'all are doing the dang thing but anyways this is the last of the blazers this one i don't know what this material is called i almost said it's called tiger tooth but i'm calling it tiger tooth but this one is actually one of my favorites i paired it with like a tan ish brown tank top to kind of match with the color here and then i paired it with black jeans and then the black loafers from earlier um yeah nothing too interesting about this one but yeah Last but not least is this purple dress from H&M. I've had this dress for a minute and I was like, I'm not gonna wear it until I get the, out, the shoes I want it to go with. Now that I have it on, I'm not really sure if it goes. Let me know if you feel like it goes. I don't know, I'm still like indecisive. It's this purple long dress and it has like this scent thing from, it's from H&M and I really think it's so cute. I did that and you can't even see the shoe. I'll take like a video where you can see the shoe. It feels like I'm out of breath because I'm standing in these high heels When's the last time I've been wearing these? And there I go cutting myself out of the video again. But yeah, let me know your thoughts on if you think it matches or doesn't. I saw my cousin wear it and she has the same one and she wore it so nicely. It looks, I will then put a picture of her somewhere. If it doesn't happen, don't even at me. But somewhere there'll be a picture of how she wore it and I think it looks really good on her. As I'm filming this, my cousin goes, you look like the one girl from Scooby-Doo. Is that shade? No. I feel like it's shade. The boots were from Nasty Gal, which is like gonna be the next um, clothing store I got stuff from. This one is more chill. It's not as serious as the suits and it's not as like dressy as the dress. It's more like jumpers and like a corduroy shirt. So that will be pretty much it. And then we'll be out of here. Okay, so next we have this pink corduroy shirt from Nasty Gal and the white tank top that I paired with and then some gray Levi's and then I put it on with some white forces. I feel like this I could get a little with like wearing like a gray sweater under or something because it's really thin. It wouldn't, it's not going to last me working like outside in this cold weather, but yeah, I really like it. I just feel like the color pops. Okay, you'll have to excuse that loud alarm. What is it? Fire alarm? Like, I don't know why it's going off. My mom's in the kitchen cooking. I don't even know if you can hear the noise, but it's just being ridiculous. But next I have this three piece. This thing is warm. This three piece, it's a sweater, a tank, and a um, joggers from She by Sheree. No, I'm just kidding. What happened to She by Sheree? Joggers. Excuse me? Joggers. <laughs> Uh, nasty gal, but yeah, it's really warm. I feel like this works like on days where I want to work from home. I'm not, I'm just working from home, so there's nothing to pair it with. I like the color, it's giving comfort. The pants are like, or like, I don't know, it feels large. And this was a medium, so excuse what it looks like when you see the full thing. This has zip right here. I wish I could even take credit for finding it. Again, I'm gonna mention my cousin, she, cause she's out for gold. I saw her wear, I don't know if it's this exact one, but this sweater with like this whole thing, the color and everything, I saw her, she had it. And I was like, where did you get that from? She's like, oh, it's nasty out. And I checked, she was in the UK. And then I checked here and we didn't have it sold out. And then all of a sudden, I was like, let me check again. And they had it. Let me show them. Are you coming in Can you see it? Like, look at the color. Look at the color. Look at the color. Exactly. Anyways, I really like this half zip. It's probably one of my favorite from like the, everything that I've tried on. But you can never go wrong with the half zip. And the color looks so nice. And then I paired it with some light Levi's and then a pair of CDGs. I'm gonna show you my shoes. If you make fun of my shoes, you're anti-black. I don't make the rules. Last but not least, this blue crew neck. Before I get into this, I just want to say thank you for watching all the way here. Even if you didn't, thank you for watching. It's not an everyday vlog. I don't know when the next vlog is coming, but I'll try to get something out. I'm not gonna make no promises. I'm gonna feel like a liar. But yeah, so this is just a blue crew neck. It's the same as the um, half zip, 
This one's on the longer side. I like the color, it's really warm. Like I'm already overheating in this and it's like pretty cool in our house. I just wore some black jeans and then some Cortezes. And that's pretty much it. Um, let me show you what it looks like on. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and share. I really appreciate you all for watching, and I hope to see you on the next video. All right, and if you have any recommendations for something you'd like to see, if you put it in the comment section, I might be able to do it. No promises, life has been hard. But yeah, thank you again for watching. I hope to see you on the next one. Bye.